Good morning ladies and gents, how you doing? It's Danny Stewart here from BaseJapanDirect.com with another Naked Sound review um, on this uh, Edwards uh, Tetsuya model. It's the uh, um, ET, uh, what's it called? ETB 170. Um, and uh, yeah, it's uh, the neck is made in Japan and everything is assembled and finished in Japan. I think the body is imported from Korea um, and the electronics are um, all Seymour Duncan bass lines. Um, I think I prefer this personally to the um, Lackland version um, of the Tetsuya model. Um, similar price um, but I, I think the hardware on this is actually a, a bit better um, the uh, the bridge certainly is in my opinion better than the Lackland bridge uh, you can get a better setup on this I also prefer slightly prefer the sound of the pickups on this one too um, it's just my personal preference but uh, yeah um, and you know you've got a, an ash body it's a light ash body with um, a laminated quilt top um, looks really nice and uh, yeah the one piece maple neck with a maple fretboard on top and abalone inlays bone nut you know it's good stuff it's well made it's put together nicely and it plays really really nicely so yeah thoroughly recommend it let's take a listen to how it sounds here we go then we're going to go front pick up with the uh Bass and mid boosted and treble at notch. Now we're going to add the treble to that equation and uh, we'll go balanced and double that up. I'll go on I'll go here so that we use uh, the higher strings. Alright, let's go through. 
uh, settings quickly on this. Just start the rear pickup. Everything dialed up. Front coil at the rear pickup. Just uh, check out the baseline. So that's um, the front coil. As you can hear, there's a lot of um, scope on the on the treble there, and the mid is quite bright too. It's not such a, a warm mid on this. It's more like a music man placement as well. So it won't sound like a jazz bass. If I go to the very other extreme, go on the on the rearmost coil, you get this tone. So yeah, that's uh, pretty sweet. And then uh, in the mid, we set it in the middle. Full calls. And then, uh, you know, again, if you cut the bit, if you cut the treble, you get this sound. It's not really a traditional sort of jazz pickup sound there, of course. It's it's more like a music man. Um, if we go full coils, now everything dialed up. A music man sort of slap tone. You get this. Up, and we got the front coil of the rear pickup, everything dialed up for a slap as well. Get this tone. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
See how that sounds. So we'll just go with everything turned up from pickup. Up, bass, mid, boosted, treble, and notch. Just add the treble to that, give it a bit more definition. you a good idea of everything. I'll just slap a little bit on the front pickup now to end. gives you an idea of uh, the tonal scope of this thing. It's, it's, it's really quite good, you know. If you like the Music Man sound, this is a great bass for you. Um, compared to the Lackland Skyline version, I actually think this is better. I prefer 
the tone of this. Uh, playability is much the same. Actually, the bridge, I think is this is a better bridge. Um, it sets up a bit better than the Lackland version, in my opinion. Price-wise, it's very much on a par. Same, about 170,000 yen, new. And therefore, second-hand, we're looking at you know half that sort of price for one that's in good condition, like this. So, there you go. Thanks again for watching another Naked Sound Review. See you again.